Hello, welcome to next tutorial. So now I'm going to show you the second tutorial how to sell restaurant reservation system. Same as previous thing, provide your email address and password and then fill out this capture and click on login. After clicking that, you'll get an interface that is a admin interface or admin dashboard. Okay, so you'll get this interface. Our first videos, uh, we have shown you how to manage order. All right, so now I will show you how to reserve a restaurant. That means restaurant reservation system. All right, so first of all, I will click um, for options, reservation, add booking, on available day, and uh, reservation setting. All right. So in this case, I mean, what you have to do first of all, you have to um, you have to setting your restaurant. That means come on reservation setting. Uh, in that case, you have to set up your restaurant opening time and restaurant closing time. That means when do you open your restaurant? So set that time. All right. So closing time says when do you close your restaurant? All right. So basically, it, you have it depend on a restaurant manager or restaurant owner, and they will set it uh, depending on that location, all right, or some other restaurants, all right. After selecting that, then come on that section, max reserve person. That means how many person can make a reservation at a time. So you are, if you want, you can enhance that amount ten person. If you have more cap ability, then you can enhance that amount. You can sit here 20 people, you can sit here 15 people. All right, so now I'm keeping here five people. After selecting that, you just click on save. All right, after click on save, then it will automatically be added. Okay, so this is a reservation setting. Okay, so now I'm going to um, an available day. Okay, so on available day means in which day your restaurant will be closed depending on your location all right so in that case set your time here suppose your restaurant will be closed in uh, friday in a week okay just select on friday and uh, your start time will never is required so when do you start just click on that and in time provide your in time and status is inactive or active so basically, this on every level they shows that your restaurant is inactive. So in that case, you can click on inactive. After providing that information, just click on add. All right. So your customer, that means or those who will apply for restaurant reservation, so they will see uh, that um, day that who in which date you are closing your restaurant. All right. So that's why it's an important time however it's very simple so now you have to come on a reservation okay let's go on reservation yeah i'm on reservation so basically this is a customer and customer will see that okay in that case customer will take reservation system and then customer will provide our information okay Suppose date in which days they want to get reserve your restaurant table. Suppose on 31st December, all right, and time in which time they want to arrive um, in your restaurant. Suppose they want to come for dinner. Um, 20 that means 8 p.m. Okay, so minute. So if you want, if a customer want, customer can select minute. All right, I'm not selecting that. Just I'm keeping 8 p.m. All right so uh, done click on done all right people's that means people option will say how many people's will be with customer all right so basically you have selected before that maximum reservation five person or that means five person is max all right so if you enhance here 10 person okay it's a reservation person that means how many person can reserve okay if you select here 10 then your customer can select or your restaurant audience can select 10 all right so if you select uh, five person then five person will be available for 
restaurant reservation system all right so five people is available in that case your customer need to click on check availability after clicking on that your customer will see the table okay number of table is 55 that means 55 table is available for um this five person okay so number of people is five yeah that your customer already provided number of date is 31 december 31st december all right so that means 31st december your customer want to arrive in your restaurant all right the starting time 8 20 that means 8 p.m all right ending time 8 30 all right if a customer if your customer want they can enhance their ending time okay so I click on that and um, enhance the ending time okay i'm keeping that all right customer name customer name is um melinda jones Malinda Jones, okay. Uh, mobile number is okay. Mobile number is this. Uh, email address is required. So remember, all the star marks you must fill out. That means your customer must fill out. All right. So email address is. okay so after providing that you will say status a status is not a mandatory field because um, if you want you can select status after that you will get a status a status is not a mandatory field but if you if a customer won't can uh, provide here a status all right click on that and booked or release that definitely booked basically they already reserved a table all right basically it will be booked because they are applying for reserve a table all right after providing such information your customer need to click on add button all right after clicking that add button this system or the, this customer uh, will be included in your reservation list okay so i'm not going to click on that because i have already done so many uh, reservation <laughs> system okay uh all right this is a simple ad booking system all right so after um providing the reservations or after applying a booking system then a user or admin will get notification in that notification button click on that and after clicking that the restaurant manager or restaurant owner that means so those who will manage the software or super admin will get the notification so and the super admin will see that notification in here customer name number of table and number of person starting time and ending time that means how long the customer want to stay in the restaurant and date all right so in whose date the customer uh, result to arrive in restaurant okay so this is a simple process for restaurant reservation system that i have shown you right now so thank you very much and keep your eyes for the next tutorial thank you